Who's ready to go to the vet? Anyone? Not exactly the most fun way to start the day, but they gotta get their uh, annual rabies and all those other fun little shots. I'm sorry, you have to do it. You have to, I apologize, it's not my fault. It's, it's the law, you cool with that? Luckily the vet is uh, golf cart drivable. Charlie's getting her nails done and all her shots. We'll go over here, Shh, don't tell, don't tell. I know where all the stuff is. There you go, I know where it is. <laughs> there you go, screw it. You're gonna get me in trouble, dude. Oh, there we go. All done, and you got your nails done? Hold on. Yeah. You won't tell me, right? Okay. Yeah. Oh, hurry. They're gonna see all that. And you're free. Now, Grandma's coming over to see uh, Remy, and um, I don't know what else we're gonna do. Probably avoid this stupid rain. Hey, Rem Dog. Hey. Grandma's here. Rem Dog. <laughs> that's, that's Frankie's nickname for her. Rim dog. Get her just Get staring. You want to show him real quick? <laughs> white light, yellow light, white light, yellow light, I'm white light, yellow nice light, white light, yellow light. <laughs> Still puppy at heart. Bless her. Um, let's see. So we're discovering little Rem. Loves the ring. Hi, Marbar. Shots in the butt today. She's not very happy. Yeah, your happy grandma's here now, right? My girls. Rest your double chin. Look <laughs> you normal at her, right? I am. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Guess who's got the chin? <laughs> I'm sorry, the... Ram. Oh, you say hi oh, to the camera now? so beautiful, baby. Say hi. Hi. Yeah. She said, she said hi. She said hi. That was your first word. Hi. You hi. It's sad, but today is the day I was looking forward to for a while. I got all my lights. I um, am going to switch out all the lights in the house, in the living room. That way, white balancing, it doesn't turn us yellow, because right now I'm probably yellow, but... This I'll, is the thing you look forward to, guys. This is, no, but this is going to be fun, because I'm going to show you before and after. Okay, ready? Here's the before. This one I've already done right now, so you can tell the difference. This is one, or this is one side of the house. You ready, guys? The lighting is so much better. I already know. I don't even have to look at the camera. Like, I know. Is it better? It better. Worth it. But I get that. I, I missed that, that one. But now I, I actually I do miss get, that one. But I get why people say the warmer one because it is more inviting. Yeah, but look at, okay, look at the difference though. Look at, it just seems dingy. Like if you look no, at this. doesn't it? I feel like if you see this and then you go here, it just seems, that's why we always have these in white. I don't know, it seems dingy to me. It just looks cleaner. It actually makes it seem a little bit fancier or something like that. I don't know, I like it a lot. Hi. Yes, is my husband an idiot for wanting to get the white lights instead of the yellow lights? Kind of. We gotta do that. That's what we're doing else this weekend. Bye. Is this. Is that your banana phone? It's like, look at that, no more yellow. I love it, I love it so much. The what? Our house is a wreck with white stuff and boxes. Actually, you know what? Come stand over here, I wanna, I'm just curious. I gotta look so much better. Well, that. See, now we can see a little Remster a lot easier too. We gotta put our little tent back up. There's our little tent. Now I can white balance off of Marley. Hey, how's it going? All right, guys. Well, I will see you tomorrow. Actually, I will see you on Saturday right about now. A lot of you guys have been saying that our, like every time I show you that it's raining, that we need to clean the gutters. Otherwise, our thing's going to fall through. Basically, our little porch thing. And I just, you're absolutely right. Look at this. Disgusting. Don't judge me. It's been either raining or we've been traveling. And it doesn't help that we uh, have so many trees. You guys remember when I did that crazy uh, reeking month of my life? Well, look, it's all back. That was all up in our gutters. This is slightly embarrassing. 
And it's been, we didn't do it since after, we didn't do the hurricane, did we? Yeah, we did. We did it after the hurricane? Yeah. Man card achieved again. This is like night and day. Very, very proud of myself. Little things in life. Now no more leaking, hopefully. Little puppuccinos. I was like, oh, they did so good. So I'm like, little puppuccinos, the little dog treats. All right, good girl. So you don't like it? There you go, buddy. This is a good idea because it does look like it's going to rain, which oddly enough, I'm, oh, there's dirt all over this thing. I got to clean it. Oddly enough, I am so excited because I want to see if the gutters work. Also, you guys notice something? Do you notice a little bit? You notice how everything's not orange right now? Everything's looking really nice and clean and bright and vibrant. You're welcome, internet. Now everything's true, true. You don't want one? Nope. I gotta take a shower. There's probably stuff all over my face. Good old Rem Dog was all ready, didn't do anything here, and then all of a sudden we're like, oh, good, we're done. Plump out the mouth. She puked. So now we get to choose, or I get to choose. And we're learning. That took us maybe. It was like a roughly like an hour. About an hour just to get little dudes. She just. She's really, so I think I spoke a little too soon and I was like, she's great. I mean, she is a great baby, but she's had a rough like 24, 48 hours where she's a little bit more colicky and like, I see what people say the first two weeks are tough. I think ours was the, it's the first three weeks. Yeah. I, she just had a really rough night last night. Sun is glaring and we have that sun thing right yeah. there, but it's not been covering her enough. So I've been holding my hand back like this and double checking. So this yeah. is. This is a dad copter right now, yep. just making sure. Yeah, We just went and saw my brother and sister-in-law and Lila. The last time they were here, unfortunately, they didn't really get to see her. Oh, hi. Hi, baby. I got to tell you, I think my brother's got baby fever. I'm pretty positive my brother has baby fever. He also, by the way, he got the third giggle ever. Like men have babies, how like their whole demeanor changes. Yeah. Like they're like tough or like, oh, I don't really care, babies, whatever. My brother, I can tell you, was the person, as soon as he had a baby, it was like he completely trained, like changed. Like the way he talks, the things that he does, right. like dancing, like he dances with her so much more. I don't know, you do it too, like yeah. you singing to her. Oh my God. Oh, wow, that's so cool. You want five stars, you better get me here fast. I prefer to take drive silently. Good, I was gonna hang out here with Sir, my baby. The second lane from right to take exit two I said silent. She was starting to get a little fussy. What do we got up there, Zoe? Got cheeseburgers. You'll get it in your food. <laughs> I feel so bad just because of the fact that we were gone and the dogs are like two, two, two and a half hours now. <laughs> yes, I'm sorry. Two hours and 35 minutes, I'm sorry. Look at that hair. Look at that matching hair right there. Hey, Remy. Do you want to say good night for me? Oh, you look like you're about to do it too. Had a rough day. Yeah, she did have a rough day. Hopefully, rough be... like 48 hours. Hopefully, she'll feel a little bit better. A little We're sunflower. We're learning, snug, snug. A well, little I sunflower. Don't know what learning? What learning? All about what's going on and why you feel the way you feel. So she's two weeks now, and her head, she is now holding her head up now. Uh, she's giggled a third time for Matt today. She's smiling up a storm. Very pretty hair. Yeah, you're so gorgeous. Very pretty hair. Today was the first day that we uh, really had to get ready. And um, you know, usually it was always about just Allie and I, you know, getting, if we have to go somewhere, we just get in the car and go, leave shoes on, you know, set the alarm, make sure the dogs have food and water, just little things. But today was the first time we uh, really had to experience, you know, the true nature of getting things ready. Just getting her to like kind of calm down to get her in the car seat. It was definitely today's a very big learning curve and she's finally calm. Last night was a pretty rough night. It was the first time she ever really was. Um, it's colicky, is that what the word? Mm -hmm. I'm thinking she's still pretty colicky today, but we're getting through it. You're getting there. She just would not go to sleep and she kept, you know, we can't figure out what was going on. She kept having to go to the bathroom, so. Allie would change the diaper and I'd come up because what we basically tag team it. She, she's grabbing things now. I had something in my hand. I was trying to like, I was trying to move it across in front of her. And she went, I'm not even kidding. Went in front, grabbed it and took it away from me. Probably could have been a natural reflex or something like that. But at any rate, 
today was the first day. What, what do you think? It was a tough day. It was, it was a tough 24 hour, like 24, 48 hours. But anyway, we're going we're gonna to go for Saturday and we'll see you in Sunday right about now. Good morning, Sunday. How's it going? <laughs> I would definitely say this is one of the toughest morning, uh, weekends that we've had so far, which granted we've only had two. The last few days have been pretty rough. We're starting to find out that Remy just likes to be next to her mom and dad. Luckily, we have this little awesome movable thing Allie's grandma got and a mosquito net or a bug net if you want because she doesn't like, we have the, the baby monitor going and everything like that. She was listening to the Beatles. Now you can come out and see everything and no bugs will get you. She looks a lot more content, that's for sure. She's so content right now. Now she definitely has a nice little fan and everything. I think she's gonna be warmer, she's gonna be cooler off than we are. Oh yeah, put your hand in there. Did you feel it? Florida, Florida. This is very nerdy and a lot of people won't know or notice. You guys know how I've been doing like the zooms and the pans and all that fun stuff just to make it a little more dynamic. One thing you guys might have noticed is hands like going across the microphone. So Frankie actually found this and actually, okay, ready? Look how goofy it is. It looks goofy, but it's all this extra space right here. So I can kind of pretty much go like this and like that. And you don't really hit the microphone because it used to be like this. And I'm sure you can hear what I'm talking about every time I do it. I look a little bit more goofy, but do it for the vlogs, right? Oh, this is kind of cool. There's a blueprints to our house. I didn't know that was there. That's cool. So rather than just kind of like throwing away this wick, I wanted to see what it would, if it still work. And then I was trying to think of what I could do to make it. Yep, that works. I don't really know, I don't have a game plan here. That. Where did it go? It's so stupid. It's so stupid. I know it was like very anticlimactic. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna do an Instagram story because everyone's gonna freak out. So I'm assuming you guys are following us on Instagram. Uh, if you watched yesterday, I did what I just did with the, the fireworks, but I did something a little bit special. Couldn't do it on YouTube because I was afraid of copyright. Go look at it. It's on my Instagram page. I, I completely trolled so many people and I pissed everyone off, which was my complete intent. So go check it out and you'll see what I'm talking about. The only thing about this whole thing now is I'm hitting it everywhere. I'm not used to it, so. It's gonna get used to it. I, I was just realized I was talking to the, to the microphone and not the camera lens. Yeah. We've been trying to get her like used to the car seat and the car and all that and traveling. And uh, I love, I love, I love the smell. Remy smells awesome. Yes. She smells awesome. I just smell everything. Look at her smiling. No, she got the smurfs. Rim. Hey, do you want this? Yeah, there's that smile. She started hearing all those noises from the carpet. By the way, we have to get another carpet because Zoe, we want to make sure she doesn't slip. Actually, all the dogs are starting to slip a little bit more because they're nincompoops. She started fidgeting and I realized she didn't have her blanket around her because she didn't want it earlier and her pacifier. Now she's all happy. I'm totally dadding right now. We're getting better at it. I get her that convertible and she'll love me forever. This thing is so funny. It like does this little vibrating thing. We first put her in there. Her face was like, what the heck is this thing? Yeah, but like we had her in it outside and she really liked it because it was so soft. Yeah, we're, now but she's just now looking at all the we're lights. Trying, we're trying to hit all the little bells and whistles on it. This one looks up, like a spaceship, yeah. actually. When Char goes upstairs, he's going to bring that up there with him. Instead of having to you know, bring up the mom roof. I think that thing will fly up there. It's official. Our baby is the coolest baby ever. She's dabbing right now. <laughs> We were just discussing how like this weekend kind of just went by. Oh, sorry, I'm trying to fix this thing too because I don't know what I'm doing. So freaking this, this is this is this is like actually a metaphor for the weekend. And How's that a metaphor for the weekend? Because I'm I'm stuck. Ah, <laughs> yeah. I'm confused and I'm stuck. It was a tough weekend for us. Remy did a good job. She had some fussy moments. Honestly, in the past three weeks, two and a half weeks that we've had her home, she's been totally perfect and now like she's totally obviously perfect but she's having a little bit more like fits. I think her, I think her body's just getting adjusted to yeah. everything. 
It was definitely a very good way to, um, what I'm trying to say is this weekend went by so fast. We wanted to do a video on the weekend, like a special little extra video. But that's the night that we didn't sleep. That, yeah. So the night that we didn't sleep, no. we were like, oh yeah, we're gonna we do should this. do a we'll video. put it up for- Did not. For Saturday, but Friday we didn't sleep. Saturday we didn't really sleep, so we're like, Maybe we'll, we'll wait and we'll do that update on the third week. Maybe this week or something like that. Tomorrow I actually have an MRI checkup, which is always fun. But at least I have Remy here to like make it a little bit more fun and a little... <laughs> Stop being so frowny. Oops. <laughs> uh -huh. Put it in your mouth. Did a good boy. <laughs> so many people out there understand where we're coming from, where like, it's not perfect. You know, we thought our life was like crazy before and like it, we were like, oh my gosh, sorry, today was just that kind of day. The fact that now it took us an hour to get like everything out the door was pretty I gnarly know. the other but day. You guys totally get it and and I want to know how many of you like moms and dads out there went through that experience where it was like everything was like golden and perfect and then all of a sudden it was like You're like telling a your black friends. black cloud just went over your head. Not exactly. that it's just a black cloud, but like a black cloud went over, over your head. Thank you for watching today's video. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and uh, we will see you tomorrow bye you know the jungle has its rules and i just gotta keep it cool and i'll be treated like a tool so don't be acting like a acting like a fool look at yourself